Hey, how's it going, everybody? For today's video, we're going to be doing the all-time Dodgers team build. Now, when you look at the team, there's definitely going to be some cards missing. I always like to point this out because maybe I may not have the subs, but also probably the more important reason is there's only nine spots on the team, especially if you want to add the five on the bench. There's still not enough to fit every single card that you could think of. That being said, if you think I missed somebody super important, feel free to let me know in that comment section. But in right field, we got the newly acquired Mookonomics in center, Cody B. Make your girl scream, make me cream. In left, if you're doing a Dodgers team build, I think you got to have him. Matt Kemp. Over at third base, we got Manny Man Chowder. Jimmy Rollins is going to be our shortstop. I haven't used him once this year. Realized he was a Dodger at one point in his career. Figured, you know what? This is a good time to give him a shot. Corey Seager is going to be over at second base. Big cock jock. I know he's not the biggest name on the Dodgers, but of this channel, He's one of the biggest names. He's playing first base for us. And last but not least, Yasmani Grandal behind home plate. On the bench, we got Gavin Lux, another card I haven't used at all, but hopefully he gets a shot. Alex Verdugo, we already know. He's got to be on this. You know, a little bit of the future. He might be gone. We'll see how good he does for the Red Sox. We got Jackie Robinson. Unfortunately, I don't have his really high diamond cards. I never did any of the grinding. So just out of pure respect, he's going to be on the bench with his 83 gold. Keeks with the cheeks is also here the lefty dominator and justin turner another lefty dominator the way this line's gonna stack you got jimmy leading things off cody bellinger in the two spot manny hitting third Corey seager mookie's gonna be in the five spot matt kemp yasmani and big cock jock for that power all the way in the eighth spot when it comes to the pitching side of things i decided to mix it up a little bit we got the 99 prestige diamond oral we got the tony gonsolin you darvish who didn't spend a lot of time on the dodgers but he was there for a small stint I haven't used this card either. Kind of want to give him a shot. Walker Bueller probably would have been our starter, but I did use him recently, so he doesn't have any stamina. And the 88, Clayton Kershaw. We don't have his diamond. Never really figured, or we don't have his high diamond. I never really decided that he was going to be of any use, of any benefit, because his card didn't really look that good this year. In the bullpen, we got Julio Urias, Kenley Jansen, Sergio Romo, Eric Gagne, Jake McGee. Those are all the diamonds that are going to be very usable for us. Blake Trinian, I know he's got it. I think he has a diamond somewhere. I just don't know how to get him. So we're going to be using his silver. And of course, you got to have the flamethrower, Bruce Star Gratterall. So the new season has yet to begin. We're probably going to be playing on Legends. So this should be a lot of fun. Can the all-time Dodgers play a good player and beat him on Legend? Let's go ahead and see. Now, before we get into the rest of our content, I would like to give a huge shout out to Manscaped for sponsoring today's video. Christmas came early this year because I got gifted the new performance package by manscape your jingle balls will thank you because manscape created the world's first all-in-one men's grooming kit that has you covered from head to toe literally the lawnmower 3.0 is not only waterproof that way you can use in the shower but also comes with an led light to make it easier for grooming the performance package also comes with some stocking stuffers the crop observer ball deodorant and the crop reviver ball toner spray and both smell absolutely amazing to add on to it the performance package now also carries the shears 2.0 stainless steel nail kit which is definitely a must-have and the weed whacker which is good for pesky nose and ear hair every guy out there needs to add manscape to their wish list this season or we can always get it for ourselves the performance package is not only the biggest bang for your buck but you will also receive two free gifts the Shed Travel Bag, which carries everything and anything in the performance package, and the Manscaped Anti-Chafing Boxer Briefs. By clicking the link in the description or going to www.manscaped.com forward slash McGunsky, you'll be able to save 20% off your order, get those two free gifts, and free international shipping. Thank you again to Manscaped for sponsoring today's video, and remember, your balls will thank you. Our opponent for today is going to be Dante Marl, I think I nailed it. He's got Kershaw on the mound, so we're going to be trying to light him up. The Mikey Man is Mikey Savage. He's got a clear and obvious God squad. How are the Dodgers going to stack up? We're going to be starting Oral and then probably giving you Darvish a little bit of a run. He's 122 and 76. We're playing at Coors. God, I hate people. Well, let's just hope that the lighting is not bad because I'm seeing a lot of sunlight. And also, let's pray the ball will carry. I'm, I'm thinking this might be on Hall of Fame. No, no, no. J Raw is gonna piss on it we're all over it but unfortunately it's right to the third baseman one down all right cody the offense is running through you baby let's go deep he's nervous he knows the power of chody cody bring it in and he pushed out now let's get it going manny you have been a lefty killer you have been really good as a general statement for the god squad let's get a 2-0 lead 
Manny down the line. That should easily be a double. That is going to stay fair. And let's go. I mean, the one thing I have noticed about Manny is he doesn't really go the other way with authority that well. But we're going to take it. Double. That's not good. If he's going to be, he's going to go home. Oh, he threw it off the line. Corey Seager out of boy. That is clutch. All right, Mookie. I know you're not the best against lefties, but it is Kershaw. We should light him up. It's the Mookonomics, baby. Even against the lefty, he's going to rake. I wish we had an MVP version of this man's car where he was a little bit better versus lefties. But again, not needed. Four to zero. We were late. We were late with Matt Kemp. Two down. And that is not going to happen, oddly enough. But thankfully, we did get four on the board in the first, courtesy of a little bit of air. And Mookie dropping dong. Oh, two, we're bringing up an in sync piece. Chad dot him up. Great pitch. That is. We're, we're in for a good time today. Now, can we get what? Okay. All right. I'm being, I'm being dead ass. I think we're in for a great game. Very late, very early. Can we please find a way to get this double play? Oh, God. Uh, what? What is happening? What? What are these three hits in a row? All right, three. Uh, dude, and this is we are going to get with fluke. Come on, Oral. None of this is your fault. You could easily be out of this already. There we go. Routine grounder. One down. I was expecting a lot of things, one of which was me probably not hitting great. So good news. That's not a problem. Bad news. I didn't think pitching was going to be this rough. That's hanging. And that's a ground ball. Thank God. Two down. 3-0. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little afraid to throw it in the zone as we now have walked him on four straight pitches. Jesus Christ. Orals rattled after those three amazing hits. Don't be another one, Jimmy. Range. Get rid of it. It's over. Thank God. We clearly got to get more runs because you never know what the hell else could be possibly coming. Jock versus a lefty. Not ideal, but he's going deep. All right. I lied. Big cock jock ain't doing shit. One down. Oral. Oh, my God. Straighten it out, buddy. We're going deep with you. All right. Two quick outs. Well, that was just not an ideal inning in the slightest. So one, two, three inning, couple just misses. Even Oral trying to get into one, but yanked it foul. Tatis, Kershaw, Mantle, clean inning game. Clean inning, no BS. Come on, baby. We need location. I'll take the line out. At this point, it's well-deserved. One down. I swear to God. Knowing my luck, Clayton's getting a base hit. Never mind. On cue. Two down. One, one. Cut her to the cock. You like it. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back to this pitch, and he's probably... I've only thrown about 30 times. He's got to know what's coming. He doesn't. Yeah! And there's... There's Cody B. Make your girl scream, make me cream. And this game, we apparently got Chody Cody. One down. We, we are all of a sudden sucking. Two down. Another one, two, three inning. What the hell happened? Wait, what? Yeah, what the... I don't know what button combo you put in. I don't know if you thought you were Mortal Kombat in this game with the double X bumper combo, but thank you. Mookie making him pay. That's what you get, you idiot. Six, two, three. Dude, I didn't expect Mookie to be the god of the team against the lefty. Dude, let's get a fat two out rally after this man just choked his life away. Choked it away. Come on, Matt. What? What? But, uh, what? All right, I guess he gets something back. Okay. The game giveth and the game shall taketh as well. I, how is that it's straight up in the air? Oh, two, we're bringing sinkers at your tits, Mike. You don't like it. Yeah. Come on, not there. Hey, you know what? I, I hope you got what Matt Kemp did. I hope you squared it up. You get a routine fly. Mookie Kemp under a two down. Jimmy Fox, literally the best hitter in the game. Change my mind. Blow bomb. We're going right back to the well, baby. Oh, two, sink piece in. Yeah! What is happening? Jock, turn our luck around. I mean, that's one way to do it. We'll take the little choppers up the middle. This is how we get it going. All right, now I'm really questioning if I should let Oral hit because odds are we might hit into a double play. All right, well, it's at least not a double play. Great hacks. Jimmy, you've been depressing. Get into one. 
J-Roll. Hit the gap. That thing is dead off the bat. He's easily tracking that down. Good news is, next inning, the heart of the lineup that has done everything for this team is coming up. Bad news is, the top and the bottom of this lineup has been awful. One, two, cutter to the coin purse. That should get him. I mean, I don't know how you make contact, but with the rage is jock. One down. Now, after he was super late, this slider might be stupid, especially down the middle. We're live. Oh, two. Old faithful. Sinker. Hit high. Down the cock. Yeah. This is how it should be. We are cruising down Highway 101. We're playing with fire. Two, two. This man's fouling off everything in the book. Curveball. In play. Through the hole. I'm really getting the vibe that titties is going yabo. Oh, he is. One door going right back to the change. Get out of my box. You are ba you are selling hard. Yeah. Cody B. Come on. He's washed. He sucks now. God damn it. Manny Man Chowder. Base hit. Now, can we turn that into a double? There's just no way, is there? 46 speed ain't getting even close. Base hit. Come on, Corey. Lefty, lefty. We have been struggling today. We need, we need somebody to get into one. Thank you, Chief. We'll take it. Eight, two, three, no doubt, titty rips. Now, Mookie, oddly enough, I'm getting the vibe you're going back to back. Let's just see it. Let's just... Let's just shut our mouths and be thankful that you have two hits. Two down. Matt Kemp. I mean, that's down the line. We got to get underneath that and drive that on out. We're going to challenge Mike. 84 speed is easily getting in there. Oh, my God. Never mind. Double. Yasmani, the hottie with the body. Is it going to get down? It is not. That was at least a much better inning in terms of how we were squaring up the ball. We even got a hit with a lefty. We're turning things around. I'm thinking this is Oral's last inning because then we're going to give you, Darvish, a roll at the mound. Yeah, this is your last inning for floating cookies. One down. I know this may shock you, but if anybody wants to take a guess at what pitch we're throwing. Because he didn't know either. Two down. One through a little bit of slide piece. Dot him up. Get him to roll it over. That's what should happen when you're very early. Roll it over to third. We got ourselves a one, two, three inning. And I think this is where we get the offense going. Big cock jock. Oral, which we're going to our bench. I don't know who exactly we're going to choose yet. This is going to be dependent on who he's going to go. Another lefty. No, we can't miss. Oh, come on, jock. Straighten it out. And after we absolutely shiced on the one foul. Roll it over. Off the bench. We're going. Ah, uh, you got to go with the man who's been there the longest. Let's go, JT. Good pitch. I I'm starting to understand why I never gave Jimmy a shot. This man has been an utter disappointment. Utter disappointment. Knowing my luck, you Darvish is about to get hammered. And that was almost it. Come on, cut her inside. Beauty. He one down. I will say, in MLB 21, I'm really hoping Major League Stadiums not only play better, but because you're now able to play on the PS5 and the game will be made for it, that there isn't some type of frame loss or that it doesn't look so odd. Because there's still, to my eyes, a clear, very clear difference towards how I'm able to track a ball at a minor league stadium as opposed to Major League Stadium still. But what did you expect? In PS5 ain't magic. After he was very late on the fastball, he's going to sell out. Not really. He was still late, but a routine fly in the infield. Oh, God. Accident. It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. I just pulled what he did with two outs. He's going deep. I took my hand off the controller and accidentally bumped the right thumbstick. Please don't make me pay. Gase. Now, this time, my hand. We're not even close to the controller. We're taking it off. Thank God. No airs. Dude, I am off. I can't hit anything lefty lefty. One down. I mean, that's not a beautiful hit, but it, this is how we get our inning started this game, apparently. You give me a little bit of fluke, and then we're going deep. Let's go, Corey. Get by the catcher. That thing just shot out of his ass. And we, can we run 46 speed? Corey, it's, we're out front, but it is going to get down first and third. One down, no double plays, and pump fake Jr. out in center. Mookie, if you could get eight ribbies, you were literally carrying the team. Did Mookie just do it? No, he just missed. Please carry. That is not. That is dying. That is dying right at the wall. Dude, there is some sort of lag because these runners don't go until two seconds after the button. 9-3. Somebody help me. Hall of Fame is my kryptonite. Well, let's just say he's not hitting well either. So thank God. Routine grounder. One down. Get him. No. 
There's no way. Base it. So far, you Darvish is doing pretty well. I mean, he's easy to locate. And when I say there was lag, I wasn't joking. Got a boy. Dot up the slider. Get him out of my box. Yeah. Cut her to the cock. Oh, don't give him hits on that. This is where I think it's about to turn into a game. I smell a Mike Trout bomb. 3-1. We're choking on our own pisser and walking. Bases loaded. We are 100% at you Darvish's last inning. But can he get out of this baby jam? Curveball in the dirt. Let's go and good block by Yasmani. Now throw it. Jesus Christ, take your time. First time seeing a righty all game. Can we do something with it? Yasmani. Not only is that a lineup, but Ken Griffey's drunk. One down. I am pressing so damn hard. I got to relax. Two down. All right, we're doing it. Gavin Lux. Maybe he gets traded for Lindor. Who knows? But in this video, he's a Dodger. And oh boy, that's why you don't need Lindor when you got this stud walking around on the team. Can we actually turn that into a triple? He's got 80 speed. We're pushing it. Come on, baby. Round the bag. Oh my God. He's safe. Did Jimmy finally do something or is it? It's in the gap. Thank God, because it wasn't even close to leaving back-to-back -back triples. I sent him and he didn't go. Ah. Uh. Man, we are just off. We are missing everything. We're going to go Eric Gagne in the eighth to then get to Kenley in the ninth. You got to have the two most elite closers in Dodgers history. Blow bomb. Oh, two. We're bringing out the Ephus curve, baby. Get him out of my box. Yeah. Bring the gase. You are early. What are we looking for? That 98 was just somehow too damn slow. Two down. And watch your tits, Hornsby. We're challenging him. We're bringing Gase. He wasn't ready. He just... What? God. It's the ninth. And even though we have 10 runs, it, we have not hit anywhere near the same that we are used to hitting. So let's go ahead and not do it. So we end up winning that game 10 to 3 with a rage quit. I really was hoping to at least hit in the ninth, get our offensive stats going. But as it goes, Mookie Betts was easily going to be player of the game. He had six ribbies, carried the hell out of the team. Cody Bellinger, I think, had one base hit, maybe two. Matt Kemp, had a base hit. Machado did pretty well. Just wasn't really hitting for authority. Jimmy Rollins, he finally got on the board with a double, which should have been a triple. But again, it was a double. Corey Seager, thank God, was probably our only hit with a lefty against a lefty. Jock, I know, went over. Just depressing for our standards. And Yasmani, he actually did pretty, he did pretty well. Just couldn't get the ball to land. As always, if you guys have any recommendations for team builds or whatever type of content, let me know in that comment section. But thank you guys for watching today's video. If you enjoyed today's content, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Y'all have a good day. Thank you.